family takes photo, wife files for divorce after seeing. After seeing this detail fighting back tears, she reached for the photo again and scrutinized it once more. Her heart pounded out of her chest as she came to the startling realization. With puffy eyes and a distressed voice, Susan shoved the photo in front of her husband's face and demanded that he explain what was going on. His answer left her shocked. One of the most important things in our society right now is our family, and the time we spend bonding and growing with our family is priceless. When you spend time together as a family, you'll want to capture those special moments and look back on them. What better way to preserve those precious memories than with a family photo shoot? Allowing your children to see your photographs from the past and present helps them feel more connected to their own story. The picture here looks like an ordinary photo of an ordinary family, but nothing could be further from the truth because when the mother saw this photo, she immediately filed for divorce. Do you see why this family photo shoot was intended to capture special moments for the family? What could this woman have noticed from the photo? What stood out to her? What did she realize that she hadn't previously realized you might be perplexed? Why did she decide to file for divorce after noticing something in a family photograph? She never thought that the photo shoot she'd organized for her family would turn into a nightmare. A picture is worth a thousand words. As the saying goes, this picture undoubtedly revealed something to this woman. When she looked at the photo on her way home, something occurred to her that she didn't think was possible. The photo would reveal a secret that her husband had kept for her for a long time. Secrets always end up surfacing one day on the next. Even if we hope to keep it to the grave, an event like this photo shoot can turn it all off. This family appeared to be happy as evidenced by the photo. What could a photograph have revealed to her that she'd missed in person? Was there something about her husband she didn't know? She zoomed in on her husband's hand even though she was completely taken aback. It wasn't possible, was it? This confirmed her suspicions about her husband which she had been harboring for some time. She now had the evidence she'd been looking for. Susan noticed that her daughter was holding her father's hand, which she recognized as being uncontrollably fidgety on that particular day. She needed to zoom in on the awkward interaction to gain a better understanding of what was going on in the situation. Susan, 38, and John, 45, had been together since college. They were one of those couples who were expected to stay together forever. They met for the first time in high school and quickly became sweethearts a few months after they graduated. Susan discovered she was pregnant with their child. Even though they were completely surprised by the pregnancy, they decided to rise to the occasion and begin a new life together. Everything in their lives was going swimmingly. They both had excellent jobs that allowed them to live the lives they'd always desired, a lovely home and two wonderful children. Unfortunately, that wasn't enough for John. The day the family photo was taken, Susan discovered that her husband had been keeping a big secret for years. She missed this detail all her life and was finally going to realize it. Instead of being happy the day they took the photo, he appeared unusually nervous. He was fidgeting with his hands as he prepared for the photo shoot. Susan chose to ignore his inappropriate behavior and just follow the photographer's instructions. Her curiosity about what was going through his mind was uncontrollable. When she discovered the reason for this in the photograph, it completely turned her world upside down. Susan, however, was oblivious and delighted with her life. Susan and John were celebrating their 15th wedding anniversary. They appeared to be in the kind of relationship that most people could only dream of. As a result, Susan decided to organize a family photo shoot to commemorate the occasion and capture the life she considered herself to be blessed to have. Susan thought a moment like this when all is well and you're at the peak of your happiness had to be immortalized, so she contacted a photographer she had met through a colleague. He replied to her message almost immediately and said that the shoot could take place the next day. Susan was thrilled to have been able to get the date so quickly and luck appeared to be on her side. Having this opportunity to spend quality time together, capture this beautiful moment and be thankful for how far they've come as a family seemed like an excellent opportunity. For Susan, it was a sign that everything's fine for her and her entire family. She never expected that anything could go wrong. It was a beautiful sunny fall day. The leaves were already slightly discolored but the weather was still pleasant and warm. John, however, seemed unable to take advantage of the good weather. Nervously, he played with his shirt as they waited for the photographer. Susan found this strange but decided not to tell him about it. John didn't like photographs and she knew that this was probably the reason for his awkward behavior. Susan looked at her family with a content expression. While her heart was overflowing with gratitude and love, she noticed that something about his expression didn't quite match her own when she looked at her husband. But as the photographer crossed the lawn towards them, John's face lost all its color and it turned white as if he'd seen a ghost. He was trying as best he could to hide his discomfort. What was causing John to feel this way? Anyone can attest this was a happy occasion that demanded happy emotions. But John's reaction was enough to alert Susan that something was wrong. 
Susan's mind must have been racing with questions about why her husband was acting strange on their anniversary when he should have been happy. The photographer warmly welcomed the family. He visited Susan and John several times and the family always enjoyed his company. But John didn't know how to behave. With a nervous smile on his face, he looked at the camera, but deep down he was cracking. He could barely keep his composure in front of the camera. John's behavior wasn't only obvious to Susan, but the photographer who could tell something was wrong. When someone has a secret to hide and is afraid their secret will be discovered, their body language indicates something wrong. John was inept at concealing his body language and keeping Susan from developing suspicions. When Susan received the family photos in her inbox the next day, she couldn't wait to be home after work to see them. Full of impatience, she returned home that day and once home, opened her laptop and clicked on the photo file. One by one, she went through the photos. The photographer outdid himself. They were awesome. The photographer did an excellent job and she must have considered how she'll need the photographer's services for future family photos. The photographer included her, her husband, and their two adorable children. If you didn't know Susan discovered something strange about this photo, you'd think this was a happy family with two committed and faithful couples. But one of the photographs left her perplexed. You might not notice it instantly, but Susan noticed something wrong with the photo right away. She noticed something on on John's finger, and it was probably easy to notice because John's daughter was holding his finger in the picture. It was as if Susan's daughter had unknowingly revealed John's long-hidden secret to her. What finger was Susan's daughter holding? Susan's daughter was holding John's ring finger. Susan could easily see and notice what was wrong in the picture because of her daughter. John looked uncomfortable while smiling for the camera. Susan wondered why he was acting so nervous that day. As far as she knew, John didn't have a phobia of cameras. Something must have made her husband uneasy, she reasoned. Susan remembered the strange looks exchanged between John and the photographer and how John was sweating before the photo shoot. It's the kind of look that draws attention and counts down on it, and she was correct. Something was wrong. Susan's surprise covered her mouth with her hand when she noticed the obvious fact that her daughter was pointing out in the picture. It can't be true, can it? Slowly, she zoomed in on her husband's hand. Unfortunately, this confirmed what Susan had been secretly fearful. Her husband loved someone else. The ring on his finger was not their wedding ring, but a gift from a childhood friend. John's hand confirmed her suspicion. For years, she suspected he was in love with the man he'd met in high school and that he loved men. Her mind raced as she tried to figure out why he was wearing that thing. She examined every curve of the ring and was sure John was not wearing their wedding ring. There was no way she could be wrong about this. Surprised, Susan closed her laptop and stared in front of her mirror for a moment, dazed. And then suddenly, she saw it all with crystal clear clarity.